Out of there, pipe smokers. Old pipe pops here. I'm uh, smoking a little uh, gold rush in this uh, Mersin. Starting to color in real nice now. But the reason for this uh, video is that I come back from the store today and the mailman had delivered me a package of this uh, box opening. But I've already opened the box and unwrapped it so that I didn't have to waste all your time with me fumbling with a knife and opening it. But a very kind gentleman. I'm sure you remember me whining about not being able to win a pipe rack to hang on the wall uh, off of eBay. I always getting outbid and whatnot. But a very kind gentleman sent me. This is one part of it. Well, all the, all the shelves are the same, so I'll just show you that. But the thing that impressed me and uh, quite moving, this fella scrolled a, 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 a G a clef on uh, a music signature there on the side of the pipe rack for an old pipe pops. And uh, he very gracious, graciously numbered the slots and the and the shelf ends so that I could put it together with my fumbledy fingers. And uh, Jay, I'm going to be real careful with it. I'll pre-drill the holes and uh, tack them in with finishing nails. And I'm looking at that wood. I, I have uh, I have absolutely no intention of uh, of uh, staining it. I may put a clear coat on it so that I can I can uh, retain the the look of the grain and keep it nice and pristine. I can't thank you enough. I I am overwhelmed. Uh, that 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 was that was wonderful, wonderful, and the workmanship. I mean, I the craftsmanship of that every every joint and every. It just it's just perfect. Just I'm just totally amazed. I have no skills like this, so I'm completely awed. Thank you, Jay. Uh, I've been watching everybody's videos, uh, trying to keep up. I had to work for a couple of days again and got behind. And Lord, I must have watched videos for five hours uh, <laughs> the other day. Uh, getting harder and harder to keep up but uh, I wanted to mention one thing uh, uh, Blythe Pipe uh, read a little excerpt from uh, The Hobbit in one of her videos not too long ago and uh, reminded me of uh, took me back about 30 years to when I first read The Hobbit and The Lord of the Rings and so I had this book sitting on my shelf for Oh, gee, probably a couple of years. I never got around to reading it, but uh, it's uh, J.R.R. Tolkien's uh, Children of Huron. And uh, it's like a prequel to uh, to the uh, the uh, Lord of the Rings and the Hobbits in a time before uh, those took place. So. I uh, started reading that, got myself about halfway through it. I just thought maybe some of you uh, J.R.R. Tolkien uh, fans might uh, appreciate that. I don't have a whole lot more to say. I just uh, I just wanted to get on here quickly and, and thank Jay for uh, making that pipe rack for me. That is absolutely wonderful. I'll, uh, I'll be busy putting it together today and tomorrow. When I get her all put together and put up, I'll uh, I'll take a picture, video of it, and, and show it to you guys with the pipes in it. So, again, thanks and uh, all my best to all of you guys out there and keep them uh, videos rolling. I'm trying to keep up the best that I can. <laughs> all right, you guys all take care and have a great, great day.